What's going on? It's Fiona Patrol. I'm bringing some more Spider-Man. We're gonna do this fucking side mission right here. We'll continue on with the storyline. I did go through and do all of the demon uh, layer stuff. The bases, just because after the first one, they're all the same thing. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. It's Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? Bad angle. Picture Need to get it straight on. Life's over. Give me the plan. Very nice. Nice clear image. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak the photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Nice long swing. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Oh, I don't know you can fail missions. Yeah, they do that cast. Or he he does that cast. Another victim? Or an accomplice? I need a photo. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Took you long enough. You? Yeah. As soon as he saw the photo, gotcha. he fell in line. Rodrigo always was a sucker. Boss will be at me. Let's see the plans. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta catch my train. Don't want to keep the boss waiting. It's gonna be our biggest school yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Where is he getting off? Tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of heist movies. <laughs> Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out.
End of the line. I should head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. He's heading for that office building. Probably the only room that's lit up, huh? They're on the move. Well, that's not um, I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. Bravo. Let him get any further away. Oh yeah, stop the car. This game's going crazy on me. I'm losing him! Lost him. Oh, I, I stopped at both cars. What do you want me to do? No. Hey, it's a different color this time. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car.
I love it when a plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night that John committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friends. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. <laughs> Thanks, Spider-Man. Call me spider Cop. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever Spider-Man does. piece on Jefferson Davis and it made me wonder how's his son Miles doing not good I've been there the loss is all you can think about he needs something to do outside of school maybe a part-time job it's not a bad idea but it has to be the right job something that makes him feel useful like what he's doing matters kind of think you just described feast MJ that's perfect I'll talk to May about it that's what I'm here for <laughs> Village. See, it's raining. All his clothes will be wet. All his clothes should be wet. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. How? His name is Miles Convenient. Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. He's such a sweet boy. I should check out Lee's office. <laughs> That's a true motive. Glad to see you're okay. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. He has these web swingers on his arm. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. Whoa, what the? High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which 
is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's journal. A key. I wonder where the lock is. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Looks like this note is for me. Those stories will be true. Lee really did care about me. Hope this means she's out of danger. That's a real picture. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. I see. Yes. Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? He's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon until he became one. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. I can feel my power growing. Feeding off my anger. Creepy. Phew. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. One more. had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I can get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. 
Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. <laughs> the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. That's creepy as fuck. Like, yeah, they suspect something. Wait, wait, wait! I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack plan. Where? When? Still working on that. But I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? Huh. What should I cook? <laughs> now you're at the convenience store. Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker, exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? This is my divining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by just for a minute. 1034. Terrorists are assaulting officers. Shot fired. Friends, today we have a very special caller. Breaking important news right here. Half time. <laughs>
demons are down. I'll let you take it from here, officers. My enemy is probably all guys. Right, come on, you're scaring the pigeons. Oh, I got killed. Fix my hair. I haven't been working ages. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again, but this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think I should do it. Ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I, uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. <laughs> well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. 
He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Don't worry, I'm a fucking genius. I can fix anything. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. I didn't know I could remove this. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step? Neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Call. Are you still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, it's dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'd be hard to screw this one up. I guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. I don't know if that As you can see, I already kind of did everything. <laughs> there's no side missions or nothing on the map. Well, I'll end this episode right here. Uh, start with the next one and two of the calls. 
I'll catch you next time.